Farmer George's Farming Simulators. UK. Why isn't it still spitting out crop just there? It should be. Oh, because I'm full. Ah, that's right. Okay. So, we will go drive course. Drive now. Now, this is the time to switch to. Um, this is the tractor that came from the uh, place. We can stop that driver now because we don't want him to go there. We can reset his course and send him to the very first course I built, which was Trav Farm to Shop to Farm. And we're going to send him on that course because he's going to go and pick up another trailer for us. Although he's going to drive around in a little bit of a, a squirm first. I'll leave him to it. The the one that I want is this red tractor. And get him to put that down. I usually like to lower it properly. And get this guy, because he's the only one who can use this, the green tractors can't pull this um, cultivator. The only thing about putting this cultivator on at this stage, when he's just about halfway on the harvesting, is that he could run into the other chuck that should be coming back about now. So we'll set him on hire a worker. And then when he's done too, there he is just emptying. He could actually be taking this load we're gonna reset course <clears throat> he's got further to take this but then again he is a faster tractor and he doesn't have to wait for the harvester and um, we're gonna set him on the silo core canola to the inn making sure that he's on that particular point there And we'll just get him going on that one. Hmm, this is a strange angle. Why is he coming in at that angle? I hate reversing these things. They should have actually, there's a fault on these, if any modders are listening to this, these trailers actually have a reversing lock on them and you should be able to lock the central um, point up, you, it, it only scuffs the tyres ever so slightly and a lot of these have a steering lock on the, or I forget what it's called, a knuckle lock or something, on the actual spin arm on the trailer and you just engage the lock and it keeps the thing still so that you can reverse the trailer properly without all the kerfuffle. Right so he's got 99% and he should be continuing now. He will take that off to the drive now. He'll take that off to the inn. He's waiting for a trailer. See meanwhile this harvest has been stood empty because oh there it is it hasn't um it's because i'm recording with fraps did you not know if i wasn't recording with fraps if i turn fraps off this will just drive under there no problems really i've got seven grand what I wanted to buy for him <coughs> was just another little trailer. It's not going to make much in the hill of beans of all things. Um, what you do here is you stop the driver temporarily.
is more or less what I did when I was actually picking up stuff so you can still see the eggs from the last course connect it up and just say draft course mate that's it and he'll bring that back to the farm now and I was oh, I need to get back to the um, right so now we need to stop the hire worker on that because he's in the way of the process we'll leave him doing that now this guy needs to be working away and if we can also get the um, The thing about these small green tractors is they sometimes have a, a, a job keeping up with any of the faster harvesters. This is about the only harvester you can really use it with seriously. He's just taking his load there, look. So it's taking him all the time to get to there with his 100% of, or 99% of his load and we are just at um, stop the driver here we'll be putting him on the other load in a minute but he's going to be ready to keep unloading that harvester the most important point at this stage is to keep that harvester unloaded all of the time and I'm also trying to get this planter working the cedar it's on the wrong side of it of course it would be but my harvest has stopped quickest way I know to get to that vehicle and you see we're at 62% on this trailer he would have already been emptying this if I'd have been on the ball and the point being that these two trailers have to work literally flat out to keep him busy all the time So now we'll bring him into the picture on the field. He also can act as a block. So that the um We do want this one full first, so that the uh cultivator doesn't run into the harvester and stop him ever again. Now the thing I don't like doing here is running down the outside of this harvester because if you're playing honestly as a farmer you wouldn't run over your crop like this and this is why I should say really if, it, if you're in hard mode it should de destroy your crop while you're running over it you'd be flattening all of your canola <coughs> pardon me so now we can go He's waiting for his load, of course. <coughs> this is where the vehicle grouper comes in handy. See, I should have been, if I'd have been quicker on the ball there, it's like I couldn't get that other tractor started really quick. One of the tricks here is, if you do get the harvester stopped, 
and you want to keep him moving as fast as possible empty him a little bit pull forwards and wait for him about 10 seconds he'll start up start moving he'll put his pipe out again and you should be able to keep moving with him and now he's moving rather than standing there all that time whilst he empties his load and press number four oh it's just right at the end of the field of course would be wouldn't he so now whilst the other vehicle is off filling up the silo because I don't have much stuff and now of course is the time to set your vehicle groups whereas if you have this group oh what's this are you sure you want to dump here oh right it's because I've got a conflicted mod and I've got a tip anywhere mod but that would be I would need to press Q um, what we're going to do with this vehicle is set him I think it's I think it's V yes it is and now we're going to move this one which is the Kramer KL200 into group 1 ok now we'll press V again turn that off <clears throat> an interesting thing is if you can start with two vehicles here you can put one here then as this harvester pulls out the way you can put another one there the trouble is you can't make it all the way up and down the road the, the run So as soon as you start emptying him here, it will obviously change his position. he's only stopped because this guy has stopped working so I'll put him back on and the cedar will continue this guy needs to be in the faster tractor for pulling that cultivator and then he will of course stay ahead tried to get to him before he stopped but he's pushing it a little bit just get the harvester moving again You've just been watching Farmer George's Farming Simulators from farmingsimulators.co.uk Please remember to subscribe, like and share this video and visit farmingsimulators.co.uk